In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up on-wrist phone calls with your Fitbit Sense. Now I'm going to be using an Android phone in this video. If you're using an iPhone, I set up my Fitbit first at three phone calls with an iPhone, so you might want to check that video out instead. I'll link it down in the description below or on the screen here. So continuing with Android and Fitbit Sense, you'll need to be on your Fitbit dashboard. Make sure you are on the Today tab. Then tap on your profile picture in the upper left-hand corner. Then tap on Sense or Versa 3 if you're using that. And then scroll down if needed until you find On Wrist Calls. So go ahead and tap on that. And it says Set up On Wrist Calls. Use the built-in mic and speaker to take Bluetooth calls hands-free. To enable On Wrist Calls on Sense, start setup and follow the instructions. So I'll go ahead and tap See Instructions. So it says Tap Start Setup to open Bluetooth settings on your phone, then follow these steps. Number one, keep Sense nearby. Connect to Sense controls from the available devices list. If it's already connected, do these things. When you're done, return to the Fitbit app. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and tap Start Setup, which should take me to the Bluetooth settings on my phone. There we go. And here it's supposed to say Sense Controls. I don't see anything that says Sense Controls, so I'm actually going to go over here to my Sense. I'm going to double tap the screen to wake it up. Then I'm going to swipe to the left to reveal my apps, and I'm going to find my Settings app. Mine's on the first page. If yours needs to be swiped to find another page, go ahead and do that until you find your Settings app, and then tap on it. And then the second thing down, I'll scroll to Vibration and Audio, and I'll tap on that. And then I'll scroll all the way down to, here we go, Music Controls and On-Wrist Calls. Allow watch to connect to music playing on your phone or take calls if your phone is in range. So now it says Sense Controls waiting to pair. You must go to your phone's Bluetooth settings to finish pairing. So I still don't see it in here. So I guess I'll say pair new device. There we go. All right, so now I'll tap on Sense Controls. And now it says pair with Sense Controls, Bluetooth pairing code. So the codes do match up and I will allow access to my contacts and call history. If you don't allow that, I don't think it'll show, you know, who's calling or things like that. So then I'll tap pair. All right, so here on the watch, it does say Sense Controls is paired, and then on the phone, it says On Risk Calls is all set. So some other notes here, it says allow call notifications. Call notifications must be on to use this feature. And here's a little handy thing, I guess, check permissions. I'll tap here. Oh, maybe that's not available. So I'll show you how to do that in a moment. It says you do need to keep your phone nearby. You can answer incoming calls on your watch as long as your phone is within range. Find the phone symbol to answer an incoming call. Tap the phone symbol on your watch to say hello. And you can also easily silence calls. So I'll have another video showing you how to actually use these. This is just a setup video. So for now, I'm going to tap done. And then notifications here is where you want to check next. So I'll tap on here. And you just want to make sure that calls is enabled here. So if it looks like this, where it's grayed out, you won't get incoming call notifications or the ability to take calls on your wrist. So you need to have this enabled and then you'll get the notification. And if you accept and want to accept the call on your wrist, you can do that with a Sense or a Versa 3 that has a built-in microphone and speaker. So if you want to learn how to use <laughs> on wrist phone calls, go ahead and check out my video here that I'll put on the screen when it is ready. So hope this video helped you. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.